Welcome back to Sexified Fallout New Vegas. I'm Rook. This lovely girl in the, uh, like, I don't know what this is, combat lingerie is nasty. And uh, so, okay, look, we've got so many things that we're supposed to go back and talk with Vulpus uh, and let him know that that girl's okay. And we're, we're, I'm supposed to fix up Rex's brain and we're supposed to meet some guy from the NCR and everybody wants us to do something uh, but uh, we're not going to do that stuff I, the, the thing I was thinking about is like I want to help Cass I want to finish up the heartache by the numbers quest uh, for Cass and look, let's look at Cass for a second here I put her in some uh, raider armor and uh, it looks pretty darn good on her I like it um but so she's a raider just in case things go sideways here with Alice McClafferty because we we're supposed to go to the gun runners and break in. So basically, I'm supposed to steal stuff stealthy like and uh, like not not kill anybody. But that's really not in my wheelhouse. That's just that is not my style at all uh, or nasty style. And it would mean I'd have to leave all the companions behind and then get sneaky and I don't have really any sneak skill at all so it would it wouldn't work anyway so we're just gonna tell Alice that uh, she's gonna have to find somebody else welcome back uh, thanks hey you'll have to find someone else for the gun runner job it's not something I do I understand no hard feelings but you will of course keep our conversation on the matter strictly confidential oh sure just to you, me, and everyone on YouTube. So, good. Um, is there anything else you, know, you need me to do? God, I don't even want to ask. Something has actually come up. A prospector recently came through here and spent a lot of caps on supplies. Closer inspection of these caps has revealed them to be brand new. This is a problem. Oh. The most likely source of these new caps is the old sarsaparilla bottling plant. Go there, locate the bottle cap press, and disable it. Hmm. Uh, all right, well, I have some questions about the bottle cap currency. What would you like to know? Um. What makes a bottle cap genuine? Lots of little things. The paint on the label, the machining, the type of metal it's made from. I know there's counterfeit caps floating around, of course. Fortunately, they're very time-consuming to make, so the numbers are small. Um, are new bottle caps ever made? Certainly. Bottle caps do wear out or get damaged. Some people even insist on using bottle caps and explosive devices for some reason. <laughs> We make it a point to scour pre-war bottling plants and recover or disable the bottle cap presses. Seems we missed one. And why is this a problem? People have been counterfeiting bottle caps forever, but it's always been small scale. A bottle cap press is a whole other threat. We can't have anyone devaluing our currency by mass producing new bottle caps. All right, let's talk about something else. All right. Is there anything else I can do for you? Yeah, I wanted to know. Uh, damn it. Never mind. It's been a pleasure. Okay, so now that we've done the thingy with the... Maybe she'll have some dialogue for uh, regarding Cass. Welcome back. Uh, what the hell? Uh, well, let's ask about the Crimson Caravan. Certainly. What would you like to know? Um... No more questions. All right. Is there... Yeah, uh, work contracts. Most merchant companies. The contracts keep employees around for a specific duration of time, after which they get paid. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, damn it, why can't I... Uh, okay, that's all. All right. Is there any... No. It's been a pleasure. Oh, for Pete's sake, I just wanted to... Cass, what do you have to say? Anything? Sure hope you know what you're doing. Mojave's getting tense. It's <laughs> getting? Yeah, um... I had other questions. Ask them, then. All right, I will, then. Um... 
uh, what I kind of want to find out about heartache by the numbers um, thing and with Alice I'm supposed to do something with her uh, how's caravan life in the Mojave well I'm not one for soft living or soft men let eh, me tell you okay I'm guessing neither are you and eh, not so much but uh, that's rarely an issue what oh damn no offense meant sometimes I get so drunk, I don't care who I share a bed with, so that's fine with me. My point before is that you know the Mojave, and it's a hard place. Uh, and caravan life's the same way? The caravan fighting here in the Mojave, it's been downright brutal. The amount of caravan space you reserve for ammo alone. And if it's not raiders, powder gangers, it's NCR tolls. They need to get the money from somewhere, even if it's Vegas-bound. Uh, you deal mostly with NCR? Anyone wise does. Vegas families pay on time, from what I've heard. Even the Omeritas. The White Gloves pay on time, but they're creepy. Mm. Deal with anyone else, though. You're taking a big risk. And what about Caesar's Legion? The Legion? What about them? I don't trade caps or supply anyone who keeps slaves Good on and you. treats women like Brahmin in those camps of theirs. Yeah, absolutely. Um, all right, just asking. Look, not meaning to fly off the handle like that. There's some caravans that deal with a legion, yes. And as much as it pains me to say it, any caravan marked by the legion is safe as houses. They guard their roads, their supply lines. Even fiends would hesitate before going after any traitor dealing with Legion. You sound frustrated. I am. If NCR took the same stand and committed patrols to the roads, then I'd think that'd solve a lot of their problems right there. But they don't. Caravans get butchered in the Mojave all the time, like mine. And so fucking close to Vegas you could see it from the wall. Um... Uh, NCR sounds like it has a lot to answer for. NCR tries. It's just that trying doesn't mean a whole lot when you're paying your respects to the dead. And Legion, from what I've heard, they don't do the stop tolls on the roads or in the outposts like some NCR quartermasters do. You're lucky if you turn a profit sometimes if some new officer gets assigned a route, the fees just get worse. Any other differences between Legion and NCR? Much as I hate the Legion... Caravan life would be a hell of a lot easier if they ran the roads. Well, as long as those companies were run by men. And that's the biggest issue I see. And it's a shame. But I think there's people on the NCR side who feel more strongly than I do. What do you mean? Some caravans deal with a legion now because the security. If towns could get the same protection, a lot more tempting than you'd think. A bunch of people would be willing to side with the Legion to not have to worry about fiends and boomers and powder ganger attacks. It's not hard for some folks to sell freedom when the alternative is worse. Especially if being with NCR is going to get you on a Legion cross. Hmm. Let's see. Ask him then. Uh, okay. Uh... Damn, damn, damn. What do you think of the NCR? NCR's my country, and I support it. Anyone who says otherwise, I'll feed them my knee. I know which side of the firing line I'm on in the Mojave, just so you know. Uh, there's a butt in there. Yeah, there is. I'm not some blind, flag-saluting, do-as-they-will NCR lover. They're family. But let me tell you what family means. You ever had a brother? Some dumbass younger brother, say, who knocked up the pastor's daughter, can't hold a job, and is home away as a jail cell? That's NCR. <laughs> okay. Their compass is spinning all the time. So they lack direction. They try to put their stake in everything they see. Nobody's dick's that long. Not even Long Dick Johnson, and he had a fucking long dick. <laughs> That's okay. the name. I guess so. Yeah, I got that part. Thanks. So, NCR tries to hold on to everything. They can't, 
because it's too big for them to get their arms around. They can't guard the roads. They can't put a line of troops around the Mojave. It's just greed that makes the heads back west even try. So the Mojave suffers. Aside from the people in the towns, it's the soldiers that suffer for it most. Ever seen NCR troops asked to go after gangs at three to one odds? That bear flag doesn't make them bulletproof. And when those gangs were caused by NCR in the first place, like the powder gangers, Caesar on a crutch. Don't get me started there. Uh, so what's the alternative? Look, don't get me wrong. I wouldn't want the Brotherhood or the followers or the Vegas families running the Mojave. All of them are a different kind of fuck up. NCR just has some shaping up to do. Maybe Caesar kicking them in the nuts is a nice wake up call, is all I'm saying. I just wish Caesar would kick the heads of NCR, not the feet. I've fucked a soldier in my time. They don't need to get fucked by their orders. Hmm, okay, uh, wow. Ask him then. I, I will. Uh, we're. Man, I just wanted to find out what to do to make her happy here with Alice. What can you tell me about New Vegas? Much as anyone else. Cazador Trap. You fly in, the city sucks a pine out of you, then you're out on the street. NCR makes a habit of going there and dumping cash. Only the strip gets fat off it. Couldn't tell you much more than that. Not really one for New Vegas when there's enough dump water bars in the Mojave to last me. Hmm. All right, I, uh, it's enough. All right, then. Oh, uh, damn it. Well, I don't know what to do with this. Uh, okay, let's let's look here. Um, heartache by the numbers. Find Alice McClafferty at the Crimson Caravan Camp and settle accounts. So, uh, we found her. She's right there. Am I supposed to kill her? Hey. Welcome back. Uh, never mind. It's been a pleasure. Fine. I, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. If there's if that's the only option, then Cass is gonna have to wait. Because uh, I do, I actually want to check out this bottling like camp thing. Wow, every get out of here! Give me some money <laughs> okay. too. Just singing and talking to the dog. All right, we're gonna go. Uh, what the hell are we gonna do? Let's go. Uh, let's go see about the brain. I haven't decided which which brain to use though. I've got Violetta's brain and Lupa's brain. Um. Yeah, I don't. I just don't know. Maybe we do the bottling cap thing. Where is that, by the way? Pressing matters. Let's show that location. Oh no, that's here. It's at Sarsaparilla headquarters. Wow, we haven't even been over there. Let's go over there. Let's just let's zip over to the Gunrunner area real quick, and then from there we can run over. At least take a look. I don't think uh, Rex is gonna like, you know, break down on us and have a, a major malfunction before we brain him. But this, yeah, what? Maybe we'll run into a little bit of trouble here. Oh man, I gotta get all my stuff redone here. I don't have anything set on hotkeys anymore. Because every time I go anywhere, everybody's gotta take my weapons away from me. Let's do this, and put Annabelle on five, and uh, mainly the Katana on one. And what else we got? Uh, oh, and my sniper rifle. Put that on four. I think that is sufficient. All right. Okay, cool. Well, I don't know where this bottling cap place is. Or bottling plant.
would probably be wise for me to get a bunch of map marker locations so it would be a little easier to get around. Of course, there is a perk that would reveal all locations on the map, but that wouldn't make them... Hang on. <clears throat> Man, my throat. I talk too much. <clears throat> yeah, but, uh, you know, finding locations on the map wouldn't necessarily make them fast travelable. Let's get out of here, though. Hmm. I, I'm seeing on my compass. I know I'm not going in the direction of the bottling plant, but I'd see on the compass that there's something out here, and it's a little marker. I, I thought it would be closer than this. I didn't realize my perception was as high as it apparently is. Okay, so we found the East Pump Station. Uh, great. Well, if we ever need to come here, we know where it's at now. And then there's something else over in this direction. I do like this, uh... This lingerie, though, this, the camo lingerie. I figured, you know, if she's going to run around in her underwear, she might as well have some, you know, fashionable underwear. And seeing as how we're, like, hanging out with NCR people and stuff, uh, you know, combat underwear makes sense. <laughs> I guess. Wait, well, where, though, where the hell am I going to go? Okay. Junk door to Aerotech Office Park. Okay. Well, I'm not seeing any other locations right in this vicinity that we haven't yet discovered. Who's this? Oh, you're just a guard. Did you know the strip's all stirred up lately? Yeah, I, I'm one of the ones stirring it. Don't mind trailblazing as long as we got the ammo. Don't forget the whiskey. <laughs> That's funny. And whiskey. I love how Vanessa and Willow do little, you know, sideline conversations with my, uh, uh, my, uh, like, vanilla companions. It's freaking awesome. But, wow, we've got a lot of running to do, apparently. If I had known, I might not have gone this route. Have I ever told you about the time my dog, Big George cornered a baby mole rat, and its mom got so mad she nearly killed us both. I sure miss him. Well, we got Rex with us now. We got Cheyenne, and we got JT, so, you know, as much as I feel for you on losing your big George, uh, that's that's in the past, honey, and you need to just, just move on. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What the hell? Alright, girls, let's, let's avoid those things. Wow, okay, this is a long way. What's this stuff over here? I don't know, there's some bunch of markers, places we haven't been, but that's not my interest. Aha! There's a bottling, a big bottle over there, and I'm assuming that's a bottling plant. Yep, Sunset Sarsaparilla. Fan freaking fantastic. What's over here? The empty truck. All right, cool. Well, we discovered the 
Sunset Bass Bass Barilla Bottling Plant headquarters thing. So, I guess uh, we're going to just do it. We're just going to do it. Because <laughs> I never can decide what the hell I'm going to do from one minute to the next in this game. But wow, look at lots of bottles. Most popular, best, what, what the, oh, hey, I heard a, I heard a robot scanning for hostiles, oh, and there's a lot of, there's a lot of empty bottles around here, and what, oh, look, there's a magazine or something, Programmer's Digest, we'll take it, what else we got, where's the robot that was scanning for hostiles, what is your deal, Festus? Howdy, partner! Huh. Wrangle up a stool and listen to old Festus jaw a while. Oh my god. If you and old Festus are old pals, say a command now. Otherwise, say, pleased to meet you, and we'll get acquainted. Or, if you have more important things to do than talk to old Festus, say goodbye. Well, I, you know, what could be more important? I don't think I've ever talked to this thing. Uh, pleased to meet you. New in town, Parker? If you're here to redeem your sunset sarsaparilla stars, dump them into the slot in the barrel below and I'll count them up. If you don't know what sunset sarsaparilla stars are and think old Festus is just shooting his mouth off, say star info. If you're here huh. to challenge old Festus to a game of lucky horseshoes, say I feel lucky. What? Lastly, if you're here about the health advisory that aired on Channel 6 recently, say, silly old advisory. <laughs> okay, silly old advisory. I'm sorry, I, I didn't quite understand that. Oh, you great. A silly old, ad or silly old advisory. I'm sorry, I didn't quite understand yeah, that. Yeah, of course. Could you repeat? <laughs> no. <laughs> Alright, look. Um, star info. Oh, new to the hunt, are you? Well, listen carefully, as old Festus don't like to repeat himself. Select sunset sarsaparilla bottles will have special caps with blue stars on them. These caps are known as sunset sarsaparilla stars. Why are these stars there, and what do they mean? <laughs> Nobody knows. Except maybe old Festus. <laughs> Rustle up enough of them and you can win a prize. So get out there and start drinking Sunset Sarsaparilla. Aha! Uh -huh. The legend Please of this. Step into the open I've got and you back. identify what? yourself. Law abiding citizens have nothing to fear. Okay, so now we know. We go. Yeah, that return to play, Festus huh? with enough. Starball caps are in a prize. All right. Put down your weapons and submit to authority. We will not. What? Okay, where are you? And we're going to... All right, the girls, you get a little bit freaky here. We're going to find this... What? What? There's bottle caps. Hey, hey, move, girls. Move, move, move. Come on, come on. There's bottle caps there. All right, let's... Let's keep moving here because... Please take cover until the danger has been eliminated. What is this? Man, I need to I need to loot everything. What, what do we have in here? Alright, we're gonna take all of those. Alright, girls, let's find this thing. This area clear. For scanning for hostiles. Alright, let's actually let's go over here first. Multiple hostile targets detected. Look. Requesting backup. Broken shipping worker. All right, we'll grab those energy cells. Girls, with oh whoa, 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 whoa! Please. Do not be alarmed. Or What's happening? Being restored soon. Please stand by. What the hell is going on? Gonna six this bitch. All right, all right, girls. You gotta wait for me sometimes. Oh my God, this place is freaking enormous. I'm gonna get so lost in here. Wish they'd show themselves. Do not be alarmed. Oh God. 
That freaked me out. Wow, Rex is all the way up there already. Strangle the life out of you. Got him spotted. I can't wait. And this weapon's on its last leg. Bottling robot? What? Wait a minute. It's not hot. Rex. What's the deal here? I wanted to talk with that bottling robot, but don't mind trailblazing as long as we got the ammo and whiskey. All right. Well. Uh, yeah, I am getting the feeling that this place isn't going to be just a quick, you know, like, snatch and grab type of operation. Uh, we're going to have to spend some time exploring here. So, uh, yeah. Oh my god, it's so big. There's so much to this place. I don't, I don't recall ever having come here before, but that's cool. Uh, we will do it. We will definitely do this thing, and uh, we'll we'll find out who's who's making the new bottle caps, and maybe maybe find enough Sunset Star bottle caps to do the thing with Festus. But for now, I will just say thank you so much for joining us. I hope you're enjoying this. If you are, please smash that like button. If you have any comments, tips, tricks, recommendations, or death threats, just leave them in the comment section and subscribe if you haven't. We'll talk with all of you again very, very soon.